seven hours yesterday, we only got to Crater, and we waited, what, maybe two, two and a half hours from the time we stopped to get this. And that was probably like an hour or two, hour, hour and a half before dark right now. I started walking and I was like, I was like, that's it's getting a rash or something. I wonder if we'll start seeing the locusts as we get close to the salt lake. I hope so. That whole fucking plague of them about to get the bandana. They said they're like two inches thick on the highways, it's like a sheet of ice. We are having a crazy girl locust. I knew they couldn't hear because you know how you can tell? Because there's no... But I was sure, so I just left a message and wasted all this money because they didn't hear it. So then I put a dollar and like, she couldn't hear me. It's been a whole hour looking around. On the street, it's not as loud as the last one either. Yeah, the last one was really That's noisy. Yeah. Shit, I had fucking earplugs in the whole time. It seems a lot like when it was cold outside, it's like, like 20 degrees and snowing and being on a piggyback. That's miserable now. Did you gather? I was riding Eastern Oregon, Idaho, Wyoming. Pretty similar to this. It's like the beginning of the Rockies, huh? Well, eventually it turns into... Yeah, eventually. When you get further. Colorado's after Utah, right? Yeah. It's gonna be so fucking beautiful where we're going, though, man. Can't wait to get a foot up party in Utah. You know, I wish they didn't have a rush. I wish they didn't have, like, a commitment because they want to, like, see people in Salt Lake and Park City and all the, make all the rounds that I haven't done for a long time. It'd be better if you have a train so that you can move your way. But this 
whole situation, just this whole train switch, that's what we should be filming. Yeah. Because that's the parts that are like, oh, fuck. Like, they should have fucking here. What happened to your crap? Did it go back up here or something? Yeah, you know, I, I got storage units. In case of situations like this. I'm surprised how much water there is out here. We've been coming across water all day. A lot of dry spots, too. Well, I mean, this whole thing is going to be fucking water, right? When you get to Ogden, you can see the lines where the water line used to be up in the hills. Friday's the 4th, there's 7 days in a week, and this Friday's the 27th, 28th, 29th, Saturday, Sunday, 30th, 1, 2, 3, 4, yeah, today's the 27th, so we'll be up on the 28th, we'll be early tomorrow, we can spend like 8 days, not the guy there's only like in Utah this year, not like fucking West Virginia or something, it's not getting everything in there. Oh, man, all, the, all these Brazilian guys will be there. This guy, George, this guy, Galva, Model. 
like at least three of the Brazilians. One of the guys that's just hanging out with the dog is on it. I just like drinking coffee that's like, it's fucking so hot in Sacramento. Uh-huh. Like a nice iced coffee, man. Yeah. Dude, you can't beat that. Like, you don't want a hot tea on that kind of thing. It's so good, dude. You want to drink all that coffee tea with your flu? Oh, like all your, all your PRS now, potential rainbow sweet. You're hanging out around that. PRS? <laughs> My name's Lucas. What side are you? My name's Monkey Lucas. change their name every year, every six months or something like that. And then like and then they get mad if you can't remember their new name or something. Yeah, I have only one friend like that and I was just like whatever. Like, I know people like especially in San Francisco and shit and like, like I know people like they had like sex changes and shit like that, so I knew if it was like a guy or whatever. But you know and then like but then I'll see them like, Huh? The workers that came to our car a couple times, I never knew we were there. So close, and he was like, right, I swear, like, like breathing down my neck. I didn't know we were there. I was afraid to say something, because it's like, I didn't want to scare him or startle him. Like, I got nothing that we got to talk to him. And you never know if he's going to, how he's going to react. Like, 